Hi and welcome back. If you're new to the channel, my name is Vince. Thanks for stopping by. You're very welcome here indeed. So this particular video has been months in the making and now that there's a lull in the battle between Renew by Science and Duna Aid with regard to getting the cheapest NMN onto the market, I thought I would sneak this one out. This video is head to head for the three big NMN suppliers, but only for specific countries requested in Europe. So enough waffling off me, let's look at the head to head for the big three and the specific countries in Europe that made requests in the comments section of my previous videos. Here are just a few of the requests I got from people wanting me to look at prices in Europe. And I do have a comparison video planned for the Middle East and Northern Africa, Southeast Asia, which will include Japan, Hong Kong and Australasia, and a non-specific comparison video that will cover Argentina, Israel, Kenya, etc. Please let me know if there's a country you'd like me to cover. As before, we can only really do a head-to-head -head on identical items. All companies sell 100 grams of NMN. We've checked that before, so it's only fair to check that again. All three companies have their NMN tested by Micro Quality Labs. And at the date of recording this, not posting it, Renew by Science show a purity level of 99%. Dunaage.org show us 99.6 and Pro Health Longevity 99.1. So not really much in it there. All three companies also test for heavy metals. And as for the purity level, they're all very close too. So today, the main factors we'll be checking is product price and the shipping costs. Let's take a look at the initial prices. You can see here on the left, Renew by Science are only going to charge you $124.95. Dunaage.org recently dropped their price and they're now only going to charge you $117 for the 100 grams. Pro Health Longevity will charge you $144.95. And 95. As always, the most expensive of the big three, and no recent price drop from this company. Add to that the 10% My NMN discount code, and these prices drop a little further. Renew by Science will now charge $112.46. Dunaage.org becomes $105.30. ProHealth don't offer the My NMN discount code, so they'll still charge you $144.95. So Dunaage is now $7 cheaper than Renew by Science and a whopping $39.65 cheaper than Pro Health Longevity. Let's now take a look at shipping and how these prices translate into other currencies. So let's take a look at shipping to Grozny in Chechnya, postcode 364000. Renew by Science shipping to Chechnya is going to cost you $15, which is around 1,413 Russian rubles. Dunaage.org shipping to Chechnya is $48. That's around 4,524 Russian rubles. Pro Health Longevity, according to their site, do not ship to Chechnya. So to ship 100 grams of NMN to Chechnya, for Renew by Science is going to cost you 12,013 Russian rubles. Dunaage.org will charge you 12,711 Russian rubles. And ProHealth, unfortunately, is a non-starter. So if you live in Chechnya, Renew by Science is 698 Russian rubles cheaper than Do Not Age. And as I said, ProHealth is a non-starter. Let's now head to Scandinavia and we'll look at Sweden. Stockholm in Sweden, postcode 10316. Renew by Science shipping to Stockholm is going to cost you $15 US, which is around 141 Swedish krona. Dunaage.org shipping to Stockholm is $37. That's around 349 Swedish krona. Pro Health Longevity shipping to Stockholm using their USPS 6 to 10 day priority mail service is going to cost you $22.52. That's around 212 Swedish krona. So to ship 100 grams of NMN to Stockholm from a new by science is going to cost you around 1,202 Swedish krona. Duna Age will charge you somewhere in the region of 1,343 Swedish krona and Pro Health is around 1580 Swedish krona. So if you live in Stockholm, Renew by Science is 141 Swedish krona cheaper than dunaage.org and 378 Swedish krona cheaper than Pro Health Longevity. Let's head to Warsaw in Poland, postcode 0007. 
Renew by Signs shipping to Warsaw is going to cost you $15. That's around 64 Polish zloty. Donotage.org shipping to Warsaw is going to cost you $35. That's around 149 Polish zloty. ProHealth shipping to Warsaw using their USPS 6 to 10 day priority mail service is going to cost you $23.90. That's around 102 Polish zloty. So to ship 100 grams of NMN to Warsaw, Renew by Science will charge you around 542 zloty. Donotage.org will charge you approximately 597 zloty. And ProHealth will charge you 719 Polish zloty. So if you live in Warsaw, Renew by Science is 55 Polish zloty cheaper than Donotage and a whopping 177 zloty cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. Let's now head to Prague in the Czech Republic, postcode 1000. Renew by Science shipping to Prague is $15. That's around 334 Czech Corona or Corona. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing that. Dunaage.org shipping to Prague is $35. That's around 779 Corona. And ProHealth Longevity using their 6 to 10 day USPS service is going to charge you $23.90. That's around 532 Czech Corona. So, Renew by Signs shipping to Prague in total will cost you 2,836 Corona. Donotage.org will charge you 3,141 Corona. And ProHealth Longevity will charge you 3,758 Corona. So, if you live in Prague, Renew by Science is 305 Corona cheaper than Age, and 992 Czech Corona cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. Let's head to the Mediterranean and Athens in Greece, postcode 10431. Renew by Science shipping to Athens is $15 and that's around 13 euros and 60 cents. Do not age.org shipping to Greece is $35 US, which is around 31 euros and 70 cents. ProHealth Longevity shipping using their USPS 6 to 10 day service is $22.42 and that's around 20 euros and 30 cents. So to ship 100 grams of NMM powder to Athens, Renew by Science is going to charge you 115 euros and 50 cents. Duna Age will charge you somewhere in the region of 128 euros and 48 cents and ProHealth is going to charge you around 152 euros. So if you live in Athens, Renew by Science is around 30 euros cheaper than Duna Age and 36 euros cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. Let's summarize those. Look at total costs and shipping and which one would be the best option for you, depending on where you are. If you're in Chechnya, Renew by Science are 698 Russian rubles cheaper than Dunaage.org. If you're in Sweden, then Renew by Science are around 141 Swedish krona cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. If you're in Poland, again, Renew by Science are around 55 Polish zloty cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. If you're in the Czech Republic, Renew by Science are about 305 Czech Corona cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. And if you're in Greece, Renew by Science are about 13 euros cheaper than ProHealth Longevity. Now, these prices may still be too expensive for some people, and they may be tempted to seek out cheaper options on platforms such as Amazon. As you may know, I recently tested the top three Amazon recommendations for purity and the results were far less than acceptable. Also, Chromadex Laboratories recently tested 22 brands on Amazon with the highest market share. These were the results, and you can pause the video to check the details in slow time, and there's a link to the report in the description below. But in summary, only 14% of the 22 brands tested had NMN content at or above the claim that was made on the label. So only 14% of the companies were actually telling the truth. 23% had NMN content that was below the claim made on the label. So the company at best were misleading you or they were actually flat out lying. 64% had NMN content below the detection limit, indicating that less than 1% of the claimed NMN was actually present in the supplement. So again, egregiously lying. And NMN was not detected at all in 14% of the products. So if you weren't taking NMN, what is it you were actually ingesting? 
Well, I hope you found that interesting or informative, hopefully both. I found it particularly interesting, away from the norm of just the United States dollar and the US, the UK and Australia. Nice to see other countries. Uh, it appears as though Renew by Science is the cheapest. Even though DoNotAge.org have dropped their prices, unless they're offering free shipping, it appears that Renew by Science pip them at the post when it comes to postage. Um, I'm going to do more videos on the Middle East and Northern Africa. There's one on Southeast Asia, which will include Japan, Hong Kong and Australasia. If there's a country specifically you'd like me to cover in a comparison video, please leave a comment in the comment section below. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this particular comparison video. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. As always, take care. Please stay safe and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.